How to create a new document in Adobe Illustrator CS6. We have the Adobe Illustrator CS6 application open here. If I go to File and then click on the New Document or we could command through keyboard by pressing Ctrl N. This will give us a dialog box. At first, you will see in the dialog box, there is a field called name, where you want to type the name of the document you want to save it as. I am typing Illustrator Design here to name it as. Now you have the field called Profile. If you click on here, you will see there are Custom, Print, web devices, video and film, basic RGB and flash builder. This is where basically you choose whether in which media your document is going to be used for. We are selecting the print. Here is number of artboard. Here the number is 1. But if you need more artboard, then you can increase the amount of artboard. OK. Then we need to choose the paper size here. If you click on here, there are options of letter, legal, tabloid, A4, A3, B5 and B4, where we'll be selecting the A4 standard size for our document. Once you select the size, you'll have the width option. In generally, the unit points is used by default. However, there are other units too to choose from, such as picas, inches, millimeters, centimeters and pixels. Mostly pixels and inches are widely used in Illustrator. We are using the inches here. Now again, if you choose to select a different paper size, that will give you the measurement of that size. Then comes the orientation. Here have two options. Left option is used for vertical artboard and right is used for horizontal artboard. We choose here the left option. OK. Here is bleed. It has four options. Top, bottom, left, right. By default the amount would be zero for all. You can change it as you like to leave this space around your file. We keep it zero. OK. Then in the advanced options, we have here color mode, raster effect, preview mode. OK. The color mode, usually RGB color are used for the website use. We are going to use CMYK as our document is going to be used for the print media. Raster effect. 300 ppi which is the pixel per inch for high, 150 ppi for medium, 72 ppi for screen. We are going to use 300 ppi for high. So we have all the required information filled up here and we press OK. Finally we have the new document created that we wanted to and we can start our work or design on it. Now on this new file we can start working on any design. Let's draw a flower. Now click here to go to pen tool. The pen tool is selected. Let's draw a petal first. OK, so it's drawn. Now go to shape layer. OK, create a circle or ellipse on your artboard. Now select the petal which we drew by pen tool. We will copy the petal to draw a flower. Select the petal and choose rotate tool. Now drag the anchor point onto middle of the circle. 
press and hold the alter key and rotate the petal as you want now by pressing control D copy the petal you see now the flower is drawn now to save this file to your computer press shift control S or go to file menu select save as now from here choose the location of your computer where you want to save it I'm saving it to my desktop change the file name as you want to name it let's name it as illustrated design and choose the format there are plenty of formats here we will go with the Adobe Illustrator IA format click on save now you can see there is another pop-up asking you in which version you want to save this illustrator file as you can choose different versions from here I'm going to select illustrator CS6 click OK OK so if you want to close your illustrator file then click cross here and your file is closed reopen if you want to reopen your previous file go to the location where your previous file was located OK this is the file double click on the file the file is opening okay the previous file is open so we have seen how to create a new document in Adobe Illustrator CS6 thank you